Greetings, family. My name is Sister Sass, Sharon Ann Smith, right here in Atlanta, Georgia, Southwest, USA, on this beautiful day. And I'm live with Revolutionary Cam, Brother Bomani, Africa for the Africans, right here in Atlanta, Georgia. And I want to take a moment, this moment, this right now moment to acknowledge a conversation that Brother Bamani and I were having in which I stated that Winnie Mandela and her transition, who she is for me, Winnie Mandela represented and still represents the only serious, serious sister, African, revolutionary that I have known in my lifetime. And even as I restate that, I must uh, elaborate on that. Because Winnie Mandela at 81 transitioned, I believe uh, last Monday. And recognizing her myself as the mother of the movement the mother of the movement. In South Africa, we also say Azania. South Africa, Soweto, Cape Town, Johannesburg, all of her is like to me, USA. We used to call it the Union of South Africa. USA, the United States of America. Excuse me, the United States of America. Those USAs, those unions, and Winnie Mandela, the mother, we, we acknowledge you for your courage, your ever-living spirit, eternal spirit as an ancestor, your unabashed truth speaking in the face of not just apartheid, colonialism, but all too often the face of no agreement from even those that were in and around you. And as we grow and evolve, as myself, as I grow and evolve, what I can say is about Sister Winnie Mandela is that you, Winnie, you just walked in a straight line most of the time. You, you never acquiesced to fear, doubt, and total confrontation face to face even in your own family. So that requires a lot of uh, lot of soul and ancestral insight and strength, knowledge of self as well. So I just kind of wanted to share more around Winnie and who and what she represents, not around, uh, <laughs> how can I say, just women or even you know, what Europeans would call feminism, feminism. You know, like Dr. John Henry Clark reminded us is that African women were at the head of armies from the very beginning. We, African women, of course, mothers of civilization herself, we never were uh, behind anything but the beginning of everything. So Mama Winnie Mandela, my sister, myself, my mother, myself, my queen, myself, we honor you, we lift your name up, we continue to celebrate your life, your legacy, uh, your family, we surround them in divine light and love because transitions aren't always easy, especially when you're as a Winnie Mandela is, a warrior, a queen, a mother, a grandmother, and one who refused to compromise to that which she knew to be uncompromisable, and that is to the higher self, the true self. And that's something to be very, very, very proud of. And so uh, that's how I like to prepare to leave you, is with the thought that on this beautiful day right here in Atlanta, Georgia, 
Africa for the Africans at home and abroad, our brethren and our sister and in all over Azania, all over sub-Saharan Africa, not just South Africa, because Winnie Mandela touched every aspect of womanness, all of us. <laughs> I just I just had one uh, important thought is that um, the only time I was really near and close to Winnie, and you might have been there with us, is that it was at the Million Woman March in Philly, in Philadelphia. I don't remember the exact year, but uh, Winnie Mandela came to us here in the U.S. and we, as sisters, and we gathered for a Million Woman March. Remember when well, Winnie Mandela was there? and she's been many places with us in the struggle for global African liberation. So we will lift her name up, we will speak her name, therefore she will continue to live, and we will pour the libations and celebrate her here in America, all over the globe, and as we make our way back home to Ghana with the Africa for the Africans, we'll be traveling again on May the 23rd 2018. I would encourage those who would like to travel with us to check out our website. We'll give you that as well because 2019 in May we'll be doing the same annual tour that we've been doing for now going on to our 12th year. So thank you for your generous listening. Continue to call upon the name of our mama, Africa, Winnie Mandela, and you create for yourself a wonderful beautiful, soulful afternoon and day. Peace and blessings. <laughs>